stressful start for a family vacation. Picture this, finding out you don't have the room that you booked and that the resort is full. As Jenna Sachs found out, it's happened to multiple people. It's the Contact 6 report. It really ruined our vacation. Lori and Richard Hoffman and their three kids wanted to spend spring break splashing in water parks in the Wisconsin Dells, but that didn't happen. It was just a whole mess, you know, all day spent Sunday trying to find a room. The Hoffmans booked their rooms months prior, but never got a confirmation number. So one day before their stay, they asked Club Wyndham Glacier Canyon about their reservation. They asked us who we made it through. We told them destination vacation, and they just automatically were like, oh, no. The Hoffmans found destination vacation on Facebook and made their booking over Facebook Messenger. Since then, they believe the name of the page has changed. Just in about half a year, we've received over 20 complaints about this company. The Better Business Bureau gives destination vacation an F rating. People are calling us saying, hey, we need our money back. We didn't have a room. Vacation was ruined. We aren't even getting our deposit back. State records show destination vacations registered agent was Colleen Wogernessa. Contact 6 tracked down eight cases filed against Wilgernessa and her travel agency since 2016. Four cases are like the Hoffmans, with reservations canceled by the agent and not refunded weeks later. One recent case says upon the travelers arriving in Aruba, they discovered they had no place to stay. It was just a big whole ordeal of, you know, trying to get our funds back. Contact 6 emailed Destination Vacation. Wogernessa told us all small claims cases have been satisfied in full, even if it doesn't reflect that online. And we rent condos for owners of Wyndham Timeshare to help cover their ownership costs. She says Wyndham Timeshare is screwing over their owners by putting new restrictions in place over the last year on how often and to whom they can rent out their units. The Hoffmans take away about destination vacation. They are not supposed to be doing this. Destination vacation blamed Wyndham's front desk for canceling units and not giving notice to owners. How do you run a business like that and still get reservations. Club Wyndham is part of Travel and Leisure, which told Contact 6, online consumers should ensure the party they're purchasing from has the ability to facilitate the transaction and will guarantee the consumer gets what they paid for. For Club Wyndham, that's extraholidays.com. It was not fun. The Hoffmans booked another room in the Dells and say after filing a credit card dispute, BBB complaint and sheriff's report, got a full refund of $685 in May. But they say it's not about the money. It's about destination vacation, renting out rooms they can't guarantee. She's still on Facebook. She's still renting rooms out. I'm Jenna Sachs, Contact 6. Club Wyndham Glacier Canyon is adjacent to the Glacier Canyon Lodge run by the Wilderness, but the two are owned and operated separately. The Wilderness tells Contact 6 guests should always book directly with Club Wyndham or WildernessResort.com to make sure their reservations are legitimate.